Hello there, my purple bandidos, and welcome back to more Let's Play Pokemon Y2. I'm Purple Rodri. Last time, we caught the three legendary Pokemon of Sinnoh, Yuxi, Mesprit, and Nacelf. In today's episode, we're actually going to go after another Sinnoh-related event, and we need to make our way to Undela Town, because that's where this is going to take place. Now, it's been a while since we've been to Undela Town, so I wonder if anything has changed around here. Let's go ahead and land then, and- Oh, look! It's our rival Tommy! What's up, dude? What? It isn't like I came here because I heard rumors about Cynthia being here and I wanted to challenge her or anything. I was interested in the Abyssal Ruins. See, here's proof. You can have it. There we go. We obtained HMO6 Dive and he mentioned something about the Abyssal Ruins. It's Dive. If you have a Pokemon that knows it, you can dive to the ocean floor. If it wasn't for you, I wouldn't have found my sister's Purloin or should I start her Leopard? Okay, Rodri. Let's see who Aspersia's strongest Pokemon. Go get him, guys. Here we go, Rodri versus Tommy. We're gonna be battling our rival. Now, this isn't exactly what I planned for us to do today, but we're gonna go ahead and do it anyways. We're challenged by Pokemon trainer Tommy and his Alpha Zone. All right, let's go ahead and take it on then. As you can see, it should be a pretty easy fight. We do out level Tommy by quite a bit. Thanks for the tips, guys. I went ahead and put up Nadar in front because it should be pretty easy to take down the Unfazant. I'm actually thinking that this battle is going to be one of our easiest ones we've had in a while. You know, with legendaries and trainers in general. You guys have seen we've been struggling. Battling gets you always gets me riled up. So I'm hoping that, you know, we'll be able to breeze through one and, you know, get a little breathing room. You know, what I've heard like some people do is like, you know, I don't know, just random strategies. Like if you're playing football, I know that. You know, if you're playing football, you have like one team that you play at the beginning of the season that may not be as good as you just to get you pumped up. And I'm thinking that might be what Tommy is for us today because we're going to be going after a very strong trainer. Ooh, Buffalaunch. Nice. I'm going to go ahead and bring out Acero then. When the heck did this guy get a Buffalaunch? All right, Tommy. I don't know where you've been catching your Pokemon, my man, but uh, I'm digging it. I'm digging it. I'm liking it. He's taking a whole little page out of Alder's playbook. Hope you guys are enjoying your week. Today's Thursday. Man, the week's been flying. We've been doing quite good, though. We've been catching legendaries and having a really good time. I know personally I've been enjoying the legendary hunting and the kind of post-game we've been going through. And I'm actually very excited to see what else is coming. I know that soon enough uh, we're going to be out of legendaries. And then after, it's going to be decision time to see what we want to do. Flygon's coming out. Let's go a little Flygon on Flygon. You know what I'm saying? I like this. Let's send out Mirth. You know, I like going into this, you know, action pack things i like going in there and making things hard on myself yes I, I do that very often we're gonna go for the dragon claw i'm guessing that's probably gonna take down this flygon we're pretty much one hitting his pokemon it's not even a problem right now that's what happens when you're so over leveled well we're not even over leveled he's just very under yep bring out electros oh crap um i don't know what we'll be able to do to the electros but i'm gonna try to dragon claw it down we don't really have any other pokemon that would do too well against it. I'm pretty sure Electros has Levitate. It also has Dragon Claw. Mother Fudger. Oh, wow. Didn't do that much. The Berry, of course, is going to do a lot, though. You mother... I don't like Electros, you know? Their whole Levitate thing just kind of freaks me out. You know, if I was running around my house or the street or something, just running around like, you know, 3 a.m., and I saw an eel, you know, an eel coming at me, and it was levitating, I think I would think I, I went crazy. I don't know about you guys, but that's not something I want to bump into. If you ever see an eel that is hovering and shooting electricity out of its face, out of its eyeballs, you run, all right? And you don't look back. You know, you take it and you get the heck out of there. Empor is down. See you later. Uh, let's see what's coming out next. Simipor. Um, I guess I'll switch out. Let's bring out Nagini. Might as well get a little experience around the team, you know? It's also not the last rival battle, if you're thinking that. We do have a couple rival battles left to go, guys. So, not to worry. We'll still have time to take on our rival Tommy and whoop his butt one more time. This is the second before the last one. So, you know, it's a, it's a little bit of a warm-up. There goes Simipore. I think with that, is that his last Pokemon? I don't even know. It's been a KO fest. We defeated Pokemon Trainer Tommy. This is better yet refreshing feeling. We got 6,400 for winning. Rodri, I'm really glad you're my friend. Me too. See you later, buddy. All right, I need to go in here. And, whoa. Mmm, it's so warm here. Let me get to the point. I have papers that Lord Getz has left behind. With these, you can read the ancient scripts in the Abyssal Ruins. As my own small little way to atone for my sins, I'll read them to you. We are now able to read the Abyssal Ruins script. 
Just to make sure you know, you reach the Abyssal Ruins by using Diving Undella Bay. And you must write down the ciphers you find in the Abyssal Ruins by yourself. Thanks. We're going to go ahead and heal up. Now, I don't know if we're going to do the Abyssal Ruins yet. If you guys think we should, then I'll give it a shot. I know that the Abyssal Ruins are tough. I remember doing them um, in the original, uh, you know, Unova. And it was tough, man. Two years ago, in-game time, the Abyssal Ruins were not fun. Uh, if you guys want me to do it, I'll probably do it. It's just, a, you know, an extra little challenge. But we'll see how it goes. All right, now that we've gone ahead and done that, not much else we can do with the sage here. But as you heard Tommy say, Cynthia is somewhere around here. And if I'm correct, she's going to be inside of this building. And wow, there she is. What's this? What's your name? Okay, I'll remember that. Rodri, nice to meet you. I'm Cynthia. I'm a Pokemon trainer too, like you. I have an insatiable curiosity for research of Pokemon myths. I'm sure you know about Undelebe's Abyssal Ruins, right? I'm staying here at my friend's villa so I can investigate them. In order to get to know each other better as Pokemon trainers, I would like our Pokemon to have a match. Would you care to be my opponent? Oh, man. I don't know who she's going to send out first, but let's go. Before I send out my Pokemon, my heart always begins to race. Interesting. My Pokemon and the Pokeballs are radiating a happy feeling. Are you the reason? What are you? Here we go, Rodri versus Cynthia. Sinnoh's ex-champion. We were challenged by Pokemon trainer Cynthia. She's going to open up with Spirit Tomb, and I'm going to go ahead and open up with Nadar. Might not have been a good call. Oh, man. This is going to be difficult, isn't it? I'm going to go ahead and switch out, and I'm going to bring up... I'm gonna bring up my main man, Mirth. I mean, woman. I always forget Mirth is a girl. My main woman, Mirth. All right, Mirth, come on out. Let's see what this thing's gonna drop. Double team? I'll take it. I mean, we have the crunch, and it should do a good amount. I don't know how high Cynthia's Pokemon are leveled. Let's just hope that it's not too much. Oh my gosh, that did nothing. Oh crap, guys. Oh crap, we might be in trouble here. Uh, earthquake does that thing hit get hit nope all right well this is gonna be a fun day today because i this ghost thing is gonna be very difficult to take down let's ch let's check out the dragon claw maybe the dragon claw will do a little more than the bite because the bite absolutely did barely anything wow that that is what i'm talking about don't you dare put me to sleep look i know it's a nice thursday afternoon i know it's time to relax and uh enjoy the weekend in a day but not today my friend i'm gonna wake up mirth and how did I not realize Dragon Claw was going to do that much? Sweet. Let's go ahead and land the Dragon Claw then. And he avoided it. I hate this game. I hate you. I hate you, whoever made this game. Oh, my gosh. And he hit a crit. My life. My life. He would hit a crit. He. He. He missed. He avoid. He avoided the attack again. I hate this game so freaking much. I'm going to send out Barky because this game loves to hate me. You know, we have a love-hate-hate-love hate, love relationship. Hi, right, Barky. I'm counting on you, my main man. Let's go for the... Let's go for the flamethrower. Maybe we'll be able to... We... All right. We avoided the attack, too. Let's go for another flamethrower. We landed it. Hopefully that takes it down, please. Yay! Spirit Tomb is down! Now it's real time to battle. Here we go, ladies and gentlemen. Next up is comes Milo Tick. I'm gonna bring out my little Nagini. You know what I'm saying? She's gonna send out my low tick. I'm gonna send out my big my Nagini. Alright, let's do this, Nagini. Pokemon trainer Cynthia is gonna send out my low tick. Makes me a little nervous, but I'm gonna go for the Giga Drain. We are faster than it. That's cool. You know, that's cool. I don't mind being faster than one of these Pokemon. Oh crap. It's a girl. Damn it, Nagini! You don't fall in love around here, all right? Look, we don't fall in love. Mother fudge! Wow, that hurt a lot. That hurt not just my feelings, but uh, deep down, you know, deep down in the heart. You know, Nagini, that's why you don't fall in love around here, you know? Love isn't a real thing in Pokemon. You know, that's, uh, it, that's what it is. All right, went for the Hydro Pump. That's cool. I'll take it. We can probably tank that out. Uh, no doubt, no doubt about it. Let's go for the Leaf Storm. Maybe it'll do a little more damage. What? We full restored! What is this? How did not... What? Does full restores not heal love? What? How do full restores not heal love? What kind of crap is this? 
Full restore should heal love? What is this? Why, why don't the, you know, now, what if I am ever in love and the full restores don't work? Maybe a full heal works? What am I gonna do with my life? All right, we're going for the close combat. Come on, come on, give me a crit, baby, give me a crit. Give me a crit, baby, give me a crit. Ah, oh, you mother fudger! That was so close. Um, I'm gonna drop the full restore Z. I'm gonna drop it again, the full rizzle, I like to call it. Cynthia's also going for the full restore. The full Rizal, you know, you gotta use those. If you're a good trainer, you know that once in a while you gotta drop one of those. You know, you have to use it and you have to get it going. You have to get it popping. All right, let's do this again. Oh man, I hate Milo Tick. It might be Cynthia's strongest Pokemon. It definitely is not Cynthia's strongest Pokemon. All right, I feel like the Hydro Pump might take us down here, which kind of sucks. Yeah, we're done. All right, man, this sucks. This really sucks. Let's send out Aza. Let's see what we can do here. Didn't realize how difficult our main man, Cynthia, was going to be. What kind of Pokemon is Milo Tick? I'm going to go for the bite. I really have no idea. It's like psychic water. Ah, oh, fudge. We're dead. All right. Well, this has been a fun battle, guys. Hope you've enjoyed it. Hey, we survived that? Nice. All right, cool. Well, I'm going to go ahead and revive Nagini then. Uh, I think Nagini might... We only have one revive. Mother fudge. That's cool. All right. Keep using your blizzards. No big, no big deal. No big dizzle. No big dizzle in the hizzle. You know what I'm saying? You you keep doing you. I'm going to keep doing me. Let's send out Nagini. If we can get all the flipping blizzards out, we might stand a chance. A very slim chance, guys. But um, I'm feeling it. I'm going to go for the coil. And maybe if we use like eight coils, we might be able to last. Probably not because I'm guessing it's going for the blizzard. All right. It went for the blizzard. We're probably dead. Well, we tried, guys. Well, it's been a fun battle. I uh, don't know what the heck's going to take this Pokemon down. I'm going to bring out Nadar. Last but not least, let's hope for the best. Here we go. I'm going to go for the fly. Maybe we'll be able to fly away from this thing. I don't know if the blizzard will hit us up in the sky, but we can try, try, try. You know what I'm saying? You never give up, guys. Not in Pokemon. That's one of, that's one of the good things around here. You don't, you don't ever give up on your Pokemon. You always keep trying to the very end. That did a ton. I'm gonna go fly again. I'm gonna keep flying. You know, I feel like if I just keep flying, I can make things happen around here. It has rest. Really? What else does this stupid Milo Tick have? Like, are you just gonna whoop out a super ultra beam? You got a mega evolution two or something, dude? Like, what you, what, what's this about, man? Like, really? Like, really? Dude, I'm just, just trying to knock you out all right i'm just trying to continue on i can probably take down the rest of your team with nadar and barky you're the only trouble here you're the only pokemon that it wow okay 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 i'm frustrated i'm a little po'd now what can i do god all right i'm gonna go for the fly use like i need three crits hit three crits please please just hit me with the three crits Three crits back to back, and I'll be good. I promise you, I will treat you well. Hit me with the three crits, my man. All right, let's go for the Brave Bird. It might do a little more than uh, Fly has been doing. It it didn't do crap, and it woke up, and it went back to sleep. All right, so we know what this lazy bastard likes to do. Sleep and keep healing itself up, and sleep and healing itself up, and this fudging sucks. All right, let me check my bag. We have one max revive. Who am I going to bring back? I'm gonna bring back my main man, Nagini. Nagini, come on out, my main man. My low tick is still asleep. I'm gonna go ahead and drop the full rizzle, the hyper potion izzle, and there we go. All right, now we're gonna be on a fair playing ground when this thing wakes up. And uh, here we go, guys. Oh, it's still asleep. Very nice, very nice. So here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna go ahead and switch out to Nagini. Hope that this thing doesn't wake up. Drop like eight flipping coils. You know, and uh, it woke up. Wow, it's trying to rest. I'm going to drop the coil. All right, hopefully with the coil, if we can literally stand up to it once or twice, I'll be feeling real good. It used attract? Fudge. Not again. Not again with the attraction. Not uh, not again with the, the emotions we have inside. You know, not again with the feelings and the feelings, you know? I don't like when we do the whole feeling thing around here, all right? Milo Tick. I think my low tick might be out of moves. All right. Well, 
that gives me a good chance to pretty much uh, spam coil. Yeah, all right. I think Milo takes out of moves. We're going to spam the coil, my mains. We're going to just get juiced up. We're going to do like eight coils and then just sweep this team. I'm loving it. This is it. This is what I've been waiting for, the moment, you know? Love doesn't prevail, as you can tell. You know, as attractive and as beautiful as that Milo tick might be, look at that. They're into the whole weird tail looking things they got going on. You know, it's not gonna prevail. Today, we're gonna we're gonna dominate here. I'm gonna heal up like 20, I'm gonna do 30 coils, and then, you know, the magic's just gonna happen, and we're gonna sweep this team. You know, Nagini's gonna sweep the crap out of Cynthia's team right now. If you're watching this, this might just be the most messed up ma battle we've ever had just because it's gonna come down to me coiling. Hey, but you know what? You gotta do what you gotta do. You know what I'm saying, guys? You gotta coil, coil as much as you can. You gotta coil yourself up and keep that coil going. You know, I'm gonna coil the crap out of this Milo tick. You coil, you go see your mom, you coil the crap out of your mom, all right? There we go, we're as juiced as we can be. Let's drop the Giga Drain, baby! Let's do it, baby! All right, come on, one hit KO. One hit KO right now. That was it? Like, really? That was it? I've been I've been this steroided up just for like two health? Really? Like really, Nagini? Not you literally you made me use it like eight times. So you would hit like a twenty? Literally hit a twenty. Like not even kidding. It hit a twenty. Alright, I'm gonna go for the leaf storm. Maybe we'll land one of these moves once in a while. Uh, it seems like we might be out of moves before freaking uh, Milotic is at this rate because Nagini is so in love with Milotic, we're not hitting. All right, Leaf Storm. My man, Nagini, with the Leaf Storm. Finally. So there we go. You know, just because it's a crit, I'm not going to say that's what happened. You know, I think we would have still KO'd it there. Next up is Garchomp. I'm going to do it. You know? I think Nagini can do it. I'm going to go for the Leaf Storm. It's going to go for the Stone Edge. Hopefully, we're uh, pretty bulky. Yeah, we are. Look at that. That didn't do crap, Garchomp. How you like them apples? Oh, crap. That didn't do anything either. Well, this is fun. I'm going to Giga Drain. Oh, shiz. Well, that's going to hurt. No coil is going to hold that back. No coil is going to stop that one. Let me tell you right here. No coil is going to stop that Fire Blast from happening. Oh, man, Cynthia, I hate you so much. I hate you, Cynthia. You know, I really flippin' hate you. Like, you're not even fun at all, Cynthia. I kinda hate you a little bit, but just a little bit, you know? Well, our only chance right now is Hyper Potioning and waiting till the Fire Blast runs out. Or until she hits a crit on us. Biggest possibility, she probably hits a crit on us. So, we will see how this goes. I will be back once we kill it. All right, guys. So we're looking good. I think it's pretty much, you know, not really. It's close to running out of Fire Blast. It still has Earthquake, apparently. So that's always fun. But it's honestly not going to do a whole lot to us. So let's see if maybe we can take this thing down now. It took a while. I restored, like, no tomorrow. And let's start dropping Leaf Storms. I'm just going to, you know, do what I can left and right. And let's hope that we're tanky enough. To take this Pokemon down. I'm thinking eventually we'll land a crit here or something like that. Wow. We landed a crit right when I called it. Now tell me that's the mystery of life. Ooh, it's sweet. It's going to go for an earthquake too. That's not going to do absolutely anything to us. Sweet. So with that, we have took down the Garchomp. Who you got coming out next, Cynthia? Because I know that was your strong... Two crits! Save the crit! Save the crit for the next Pokemon, all right? That's all I'm trying to say here. Just share it, man. Share the love here. Glaceon, crap, this is gonna suck, I probably should have switched out to Barky, you know what, I'm gonna go ahead and do that actually, I should have done that, I don't know what I was thinking, here we go Nagini, come on out, let's hope that your super strong moves do get saved later on, and we got our main man Barky out, alright Barky, Ice Beam shouldn't even touch us, there we go Barky, Barky my man, my main man Barky, is Barky actually a man? Yes, Barky is a man. Flamethrower! Love it, Barky! My main man, Barks! The Barkster! The Barkay! The Barky! The Birka Barky! Alright, Flamethrower is gonna take down the Glaceon. We're good. 
Guys, we're doing swell. We're doing swell. We're doing awesome right now, you know? I don't think Cynthia's got much left at this point. She's gonna send out Lucario. Ah, oh, you're done, son. That's about it. You, that's all you got, Cynthia. My main girl, Cynthia. Fudge. <gasps> 8 HP? Barky! My main man, Barky! Barky! My main man, Barky! Wow. Good job, Barky. There goes Lucario. We gained a level. Next up is To... To... Togay Kiss. Togay Kiss. Here we go, guys. Let's, uh... Take down Togay Kiss. Alright, let's hope for the best. I'm, I'm nervous now. I am pretty nervous here. This is it. When was the last time I was driven into a corner like this? Uh, I think we, we've done it to you a few times now. The ice beam should do some good damage. Yes, it did. Oh, we froze you, mother fudge. How you like that? Ah, you like it? You like it, token kiss? All right, guys. Look, the tide is turning in our face. Damn it. This thing is an electric. It's got electric. You know what? Part of the cards, you, you. Here we go. You haven't won yet. I won't let you such a fun battle end so easily. Nadar, let's go for the ice beam, baby. Let's go, baby. Survive. Fudge. All right, I'm going to have to drop a full restore rizzle. Crap. All right, full restore rizzle. Nadar, you need to tank one hit, bro. All I need you is to tank one hit. You know, you tank one hit. We're going to be good to go, baby. Baby. All right, this isn't going to work. I'm going to drop the fly. We're faster than it. All right, so maybe the fly will be able to take it down. Probably not, but I'm going to do it. You know, I'm nothing to it but to do it, guys. Woo! There we go. Toga Kiss is down. And with that, we defeated Pokemon Trainer Cynthia. My heart is pounding so hard because I had such a heated battle with you. You are a really great trainer. We got 15600 for winning. I'm going to Disney World. That was beyond my expectation. What an exceptional battle. I love being here in spring and summer. I can't stay all year because there's so much to investigate in Sinnoh as well. You're a great trainer. It would make me happy to see you again sometime. Okay, guys. So with that, we have defeated Cynthia. And uh, now, I mean, I, I, I don't really know what else. She's gone. She disappeared. That girl is a mysterious person. We've defeated Cynthia. And our Pokemon are tired. Next time, we'll continue from here and probably keep catching legendaries. If you guys have any tips on what's coming up, let me know. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next episode. Goodbye.